Sorry. No, you're all right. Nice. I'm going to jump in and steal a shot. <laughs> you're looking nice and radiant with the green background. I thought I'd um, just steal a wee shot. Amazing, you've got the shard behind you and everything. Do you never look? <laughs> Good morning everyone, welcome back to another pub. We are here in London. We've got St Paul's behind me. We have Millennium Bridge um, just above me. I'm not going to go over it because I have done another pub um, based on heading over there. So today I thought we'd head along the river fun. Why not? It is cloudy. Um, it is a Monday and there aren't too many people about. I did take some time off over the weekend which was um, needed and um, I really really enjoyed it and we sort of came down here um, more up St Paul's way and um, did a whole heap of skating and just the sun came out oh my god the sun came out so really just made the most of it and kind of um, ventured around and um, hung out with some friends and skated and just made the most of having the sun about I've missed it so much it's been a big cause of why I haven't really been feeling myself and um, with not feeling myself it's been a lot of um you know thinking back to times when i did feel myself hearsay and um it was kind of just a bit of what i've realized and i'm so thankful for dave um helping me through all this is i haven't been very present lately um because i've been wishing oh i can't wait to travel i can't wait to get out i'm very sick of being stuck here and um in the UK and all this, these sort of things because I keep constantly thinking back and forward rather than actually being present it's kind of really affected my personality as such and kind of um, I think when you do these sort of pubs as well or when you're out on the streets doing um, street photography it is really necessary to um, be present in the moment because you know with the likes of my last pub um, I mean, yeah, the photos are still great, but I just, I didn't feel like I was here with you guys. So, um, which just meant that I wasn't really feeling the vibe. So, um, why I cut it short and, um, okay. There are, there's like no one around down here. So I might actually end up, you can see there's a couple people up on the bridge here. So maybe I will do a wander over there, even to the other side, there's a few people lingering over there. So might get a few more people that way um yeah but uh no i appreciate you guys feedback and hearing that you guys still love the images it um made my day in a way and um it's been yeah a lot of changes over the last um sort of reflecting over the last week and i've had so many changes over the last year like so many of us have because the world's been turned upside down as we know um and with that it's um you know, I've, I've left New York, I've left the career that um, I had aspired for so long over there. And, but not in a bad way, like it's all been good progression towards um, sort of redefining what I actually want to do with my life and sort of cultivating the, um, uh, the direction that I want to go in, that Dave and I both want to go in and sort of um, realigning um my central cause and what i want to do with my life so it's been really good over the last year doing that but i haven't taken the time to sort of stop and see how far i've really come so it's been a good week with that so glad to be back on board um all right guys we are at the top let me rig up and um we shall get cracking oh Yang. really nice down here especially sunrise like I should come down and do a sunrise pod for you guys it's just a beautiful area and then the sun comes through you know what I'm like it's all about the light so today I've got the Canon 5D Mark 4 with the old uh, 50 mil on and I'm um, rolling at 1.4 check that exposure probably need to close down for right here as he's rolling fire. The yeah, exposure's good. It's 1.4, ISO 200 at 1600. You guys know the um, exposure's always different, so it's 
depending on the light where you're at so no point in hitting me up as I've had a few people ask about the exposures this lady's got a great coat on her I like your coat I was just capturing it as you went by <laughs> thank you oh that last one I didn't focus <clears throat> Wow. How's that for London? London Bridge, you got the Shard. Welcome to London, it says down there. I'll just close down a wee bit. And we are on 1.4. I'm just waiting for the traffic to clear off the bridge. And get rid of that ugly white van. And nice. Pretty flat light. But it's good for London. That is a great shot as well. So trying to centre right up. Just going to open up again. Get that bird right above. Oh, just about got it. Sticks sticking out of their head. I think a lot of it for me is I've been missing the adventure side of things, but it's kind of silly in the same token. Like, this is my first time in London, and I've only been here since June, despite leaving once or twice. No, you're right. Nice. I'm gonna jump in and steal a shot. <laughs> you weren't expecting that. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's good. I like the shoes. Oh, I love it. Thank I'm gonna so get much. one or two of them. These are great. <laughs> yeah, they're cool. Oh, thank you. Thank you. You enjoy the day. <laughs> Ciao. You have a wonderful coat on. Oh, thanks. <laughs> um. Yeah, and so I haven't really been making the most of London like I um, should be. Or well, in some tokens I am. But what a lot of it comes down to for me is the weather. The weather has been... Um, I know some of you are quite used to the weather here. But for me, it's like I... The 10 years I had in Australia, almost every day I woke up and went for a sunrise swim. And um, really made the most of it in that regard. Thank you. Don't think I got the focus on him, no. All of them. Um, those sunrise swims and um, just the warmer weather, like for me, it's what makes me happy. There is a fitness, if you know me, is a big part of um, my lifestyle. So um, it being very cold here, I haven't been able to enjoy it in the same sort of essence. So it's good. Hello. Uh, <laughs> You're a victim too, <laughs> thank you. <laughs> Why didn't they focus? There we are. Yeah, so it's been a good time to um, sort of make the time to reflect, which I think all of us need to do. Um, it can be very easy to um, get caught up in gonna look at me to get caught up and sort of um, focus too much on what isn't right and um, it is a trap when we get to that route and um, a lot of us don't realize we're in that route either until um, I guess it gets to a point where our personalities are affected and um, it's not good when it gets to that point and that's when we should be reaching out to those around us and trying to have conversations where um, I guess you determine or sort of just open questions as to why one may not be feeling as good and um, that it's okay to have these sort of conversations you know it's, it's we're all human it's normal for us to have ups and downs and there should be no shame shame with that so um, hopefully you're in a position where you do have people that you can reach out to and sort of have a chat with, so... Yeah. 
Anyway, happy to say, I'm feeling good again. All right, let's need to have a bit more traffic on this side. Head down here. You're looking nice and radiant with the green background. Oh, I thought I'd um, just steal a wee shot. Oh yeah, lovely. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Cheers. <clears throat> the lady with the pram has got a cool coat as well. Still one with her reading a thing. So guys, on I've been doing a bit of editing and sort of catching up on files um, over the last week as I do find it really hard not to do anything. Um, but uh, what is it, Wavy and a few of the boys, we went out to the bush with them recently and did some um, uh, dirt bike, not racing, kind of just playing around in the bush to be honest, um, with them a few weeks ago. So. That footage is now um, available. Shoot a quick photo of these ladies looking amazing over there. <laughs> Thank you. Cheers. I love the black coat. <laughs> um, yeah, so that, that video, which is super, so much fun, like it was just a good day to get out of the bush, out of the city, and just sort of make the most of being back on the bikes. It's been so long since I've ridden. Um, uh, dirt bikes and although they were only little stomp bikes they were a lot of fun and um, it was a good day out so that video will be live on Thursday and um, available for you guys to watch if you want to have a goose. Kids having fun looking at the city. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, I feel a bit sorry for like that. Get them in the black outfit, it would be good to have them on a different background, but so they kind of get lost in the background there, but still something. nice to get out for a walk to be honest. I mean I, I have been out walking a bit lately but I've kind of had music on a lot which is something I like to do but it kind of detaches you from the environment around as well <coughs> which isn't a bad thing at times but sometimes it can make you feel as though you're too detached. <coughs> Quick shot of the city. Just lining that lamp post up in the middle of the um underexpose it. <laughs> There's a nice um, background over here where the traffic is sort of walking through we'll stop it and sort of see what we can get coming through here because it's where's my exposure because you've got people walking out from the dark into the light you're going to have like a, a darker background which in my opinion is going to look really dope so um now it's just a matter of waiting for said person of interest to come through and the daylight will hit them and um I'll wait for someone a bit more better. Vanna. There you go. Come on a bit more. So the fact that I'm sitting right here is probably gonna 
deter most people from walking as close to me. see what I mean by the darker background because I am affecting the traffic flow by where I'm positioning myself which is something for you guys to take note of when you're out um, doing your street poles if you find an area that you really like and then you sit in that area people are going to avoid getting into that area so you're kind of better off to um, be close to it um, and then when you see them lining up into that position, that's when you kind of run to it. <laughs> Snap your shot and then move on. So let's see what we get. If anything. Hmm. What are my peoples at? Looking chick with a cool jacket. That's great. Thank you. So, kind of missed the step there, but you sort of get the vibes. Even these guys look great. Thank you. Cool tunnel. I like the strip of light down it. wider lens 35 or so 24 and have someone standing strong in the middle filling up most of the screen have them filling up most of the screen whilst also um shooting from a low angle up would be dope yeah it's cool Thank you. The pole was a bit ugly behind them. Right. So, wow, the city's so cool. Just trying to figure what else I want. Reflections in the water. I move down a bit. Get the gherkin looking one. I don't know what's what. Just waiting for this step, and then we'll get these guys behind this room. Kind of doing their own thing. The landscape, we might get a bit of the, um, the grate as well. Which would be kind of cool. These guys on the pigeons. Yeah. <sighs> See if we can get another pigeon shot. been half pressing and then waiting for them to move into position which obviously means that then the focus comes off I'm just not quite on it today
You look amazing. You've got the shard behind you and everything. Do you never look? <laughs> Looks great. Thank you. closed and dormant like they are at the moment um up here so guys as you can see just a bit of a wander today um just seeing what it's about and um just catching up really it's been um a good week or so since i've done the youtube and um sort of got out in the streets and um sort of said hi to everyone and sort of taking the camera about but it's been a good week for me in regards to recalibrating and just sort of making time for myself you know as much as I do these POVs um, it's not the main source of whatever I do so um, it's been a busy week of shooting and um, getting back onto the fitness so um, it's been I'm excited to show you what guys what's coming but um, I don't want to get too far ahead of myself and promise too much so we'll keep you guys lingering and waiting but um uh, thanks for jumping on board again guys and um, sticking it out and um, being a part of the journey, the ups and downs and sort of um, appreciating it for what it is. So I um, hope you guys are learning a thing or two, not just about photography but about life and um, um, stay tuned for the journey and um, be sure to check out the photos at the end too because um, they're all worth it. Alright, ciao ciao.